These are the Helinox Ridgeline LBB135 hiking poles. I used these to hike into the valley uh, that I'm in currently yesterday and I'm going to be using these to hike out in a little while. Uh, on the way down they were absolutely fantastic. I'm, I'm really really impressed with these. I weigh about 90 kilos and I was putting my full weight onto these on some of the trickier bits and the bigger step downs uh, and I was putting these in front and, and putting my full weight on them and they held up absolutely no problem whatsoever. Helen Ox on their website say that these are the most technically advanced and adjustable hiking poles in the world uh, and I can see and understand uh, why they're making that, um, that statement. Firstly the foam grip at the top is really really comfortable really strong and, uh, and supportive on your hand as well definitely holding on to it and putting all your full weight into it uh, you're not going to get any any blisters and it's, it's really really comfortable on the hand I like the fact that it it also goes down a little bit further as well so you can adjust your grip quickly if you if you need to to actually use these and to open them up it's, it's really really simple you flip the uh, the locking mechanism here and then you literally just pull them out and it locks into place you then adjust the top section here depending on what height you want to go to. The good thing as well is that it's got centimetre markings on one side and inch markings on the other side as well. So depending on which one you want to use, uh, it's got you covered as well. To put them away, again it's as simple as that. I'm locking the mechanism as well. They are quite compact. Um, and you'll easily be able to, to strap these onto the side of your rucksack or, or even just carrying them. They're, they're super lightweight. The, Alloy is the same alloy that the Helinox ground chair is made from, which is the DAC TH72M alloy. Uh, and again, that's the alloy that all of the high-end expedition tents that the, that the tent poles are made from. So you know that it's super strong, um, super reliable and super lightweight as well. So it's a really good combination to have on your hiking poles as well. Uh, a couple more features. They, they've got the, um, the double locking cam, which I'm, I'm really impressed with as well. Uh, see this bit here and this bit here. To me, uh, a lot of the um, hiking poles that I've used in the past only have one of the of the locking bit mechanisms here. Um, this has two here and here. And to me, when you when you're using it and when you when it locks into place, it really does feel strong, and it really does feel uh, like it's going to hold your weight and do it, it, everything that it uh, that it needs to as well. Um, it comes with some rubber tips and. It's got uh, the, the standard tips for hiking and, and walking on, on concrete and things, but it also comes with the, uh, the rings for snow hiking as well. I'm obviously taking these off, it's really easy to take off, pull that bit off, pull the, the snow bit off, and just put this bit back on. Super, super strong, like I said, made out of rubber. Uh, I've given these a fair whack uh, the last day or so, and there's hardly a scratch on them, so you know that they're, they're gonna hold up and, and last quite a bit of time as well. Um, I've got to climb out of the valley today, so I'm going to be putting these through uh, their paces on the hike back out, but so far so good. I'm really, really impressed with these, um, and yeah, I think these might be next on my birthday wish list. Okay, uh, I'm at the top of the valley now, there's only maybe um, a couple hundred feet to go. I don't really need these anymore now, so I'm packing these away. I am super, super impressed with, with the quality. Uh, of, of this, these are uh, Ridgeline LBB135 poles from Helinox. Um, on that hike back up then I was really pushing hard down on uh, the poles, I was giving it a fair chunk of weight uh, and they withstood everything that I threw at them. The poles were flexing and bending but you know that, that, that's what they're supposed to do uh, and it was, a, it was a great little hike back out, um, took me about an hour or so to, to get back out under some, some pretty hot conditions as well. Uh, really comfy grips, as I mentioned, um, and the wrist straps are really comfy as well. I can't fault these, which is why my rating um, is going to be a nine out of 10. Fantastic piece of kit, um, and really worth having if you're, if you're on the market uh, looking for a new pair of, of hiking poles.